Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm going to talk to you today about something that was really interesting that I found in the Korea Times. Now, I was trying to see if there had been anything new uh, mentioned about South Africa and the Korean War. I've been busy lately. I haven't had time to research it very much as of late. But in June of 2022, the Flying Cheetahs, the second South African Air Force Fighter Squadron, won Veteran of the Year. That Korean War Veteran of the Month, excuse me. Korean War Veteran of the Month. Now, what it's called the... South Korea has a government branch called the Ministry of Patriots and Veterans. And each month they ha they pick a person or a unit that's Korean War Veteran of the Month. Well, for the month of June 2022, they picked the Flying Cheetahs, the second South African Air Force Fighter Squadron. And you guys check right here, sporting, sporting the flag. Well, the current South African government, led by the African National Congress and the Economic Freedom Fighters, are... Um, are on board with this as well, even though they're technically an opposition party. They're trying to trash these people's legacy. And what I mean by that is they're trying to erase them from history or make them out to be the bad guys because they went to South Korea and the Korean War and they combated communism. And there's a lot of communism within the African National Congress as well as the Economic Freedom Fighters Party. Well, they kind of, I, my personal opinion would try to see North Korea as the good guys in this situation, which I firmly believe is not the, uh, is not true. The second South African Air Force Fighter Squadron, uh, many of them did not like the apartheid system, but they could not control what their government was doing to non-white South Africans at the time. But they go in there, they go to the Korean War, and they're fighting on the right side, uh, helping make South Korea a free and prosperous country that it is today, kicking communism out of South Korea. And we don't need to trash their legacy, tarnish their legacy, or erase their legacy because they were Caucasian South Africans. All those pilots were white South Africans, and the African National Congress and Economic Freedom Fighters do not like that. Also, in addition to them being Caucasian, they were anti-communist, and the African National Congress and the Economic Freedom Fighters do not like that as well. So, but they did amazing things in the Korean War. They flew 12,067 combat sorties, um, they also destroyed over 40 enemy tanks and over 500 em enemy ammunition depots. They destroyed several hundred uh, enemy artillery units, artillery cannons. So they did amazing things. So anyways, hope everybody's doing well. Take care. God bless and bye-bye.